On this day last year, the channel started at this station, Harlow Mill. One year later, we are going to do the travel card video on our on the one year anniversary. Just thought if everything's gone wrong, there's the signal calls to Stansted, even though I shouldn't be. That was 50 for six pencils, that was supposed to cost 10 25. Why are you in the cross credit? Okay, Tim, let's get over the footbridge now. We're going to head to Stortford. There's just problems everywhere. We've got problems at all the ends where there's flooding, problems at Stansted where there's that's how to express us, so that's our train. So they all have to turn their box ball. But I don't know who actually gets to walk across. We're going to walk across, South Outfit, Bishop Stortford, Hartford East, and Pheasant. Oh, that train's here. So these hands we turn out the box ball. So out of all your days, there's the issues, that's just this day. And this ticket was £2. 30 more than it should have been. Hopefully I've got enough money for lunch, which I should do. So let's go. Let's head to Stanton Up Fitchy and see what will happen. I do not know what is going to happen. I spent the last week planning for this journey. I don't know what's going to happen. I think it better be alright. Here is today's souvenir. Welcome to the service area. It is so busy on this train. Okay. I narrowly made it. In the time of the year, we've got 422 subs. Which is good. We just passed over that bridge. We were trying to win that yesterday. There you go. Okay. So, I don't know how this is going to work. Wait, can I see that again? Because everything has just gone wrong. There was engineering work just at Stansted at night time. And now they f now the um, thing has failed. So, that is not good. Um, I don't know how the rest of the stone is going to play out. It just seems like any other day, this just happen any other day, except from today, it'll be fine. I'll just shoot the video another day. It'll be annoying, but I'll do it another time. Today's basically a mandatory video. No matter what happens, you've got to do it. And... Just unfortunately, I think it's gone wrong. So, we're going to have to get off the stance and see what's going to happen. Stance map fit you. We're going to get stance express to Harlow Town. And then we will see what will go from there. We need to get to Boxbourne, then to Hartford East, and then to Wilson Cross. And then we'll just go wherever we want. Now I'm going to go wherever I want from then. I'm tending to shoot for about five hours, which is very long. We'll have to shoot for about two, three hours. I mean, the videos are like an hour, hour, 45 minutes, 45 minutes to an hour. So, yeah, I've got a sorbet trial. I'm going to get off here, though. So, yeah. Wrong. Nothing can go wrong. And if it is going wrong, as long as we can get to Wolf and Cross, that's the main thing. Because I'm going to Wolf and Cross for lunch, 
I've got a deal to get a KFC, and I've done the research of all the Okay, that's not anything that this train's delayed or going to be cancelled. I don't know what's going on with the Stance Express situation because none of the Stance Express trains are stored for the stopping at Highlight Town. I don't want to go all the way up to Tottenham Hale because I have to have a meeting with my parents. We, we negotiate where I'm going to go, all that. How far I'm allowed to go. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't mean to stick around in that. <laughs> so, Cross is the mandatory station. Now, every station I've done the research for, KFC is literally across the road from Wolfram Cross station. I want a close KFC to the station, and it's closer to Wolfram Cross. So that's where we're going. Wolf Cross is just one stop up the line from Cheshire, it's not, it's not very far. <laughs> Uh, new stations on the bucket list. I want to travel out to Edmonton Green. It's on the London Overground and it's on the Overground as well. So Overground trains. We're going to see a different type of train. Is it real, right? No. Last year, Saturday the seventeenth. Yeah, Saturday the eighteenth. No, Saturday the eighteenth of February, twenty twenty-three. We start the YouTube channel. Today is Sunday the eighteenth of February, twenty twenty-four. On your anniversary, boys. <laughs> this has any permitted route. This is within travel zones. It's on standard. I don't really care about what class I'm sitting. As long as I can get on the train, that's fine. I'm gonna actually fucking flip out if it says this is for one route only. So I've got to go up into London, I've got to buy more tickets, and this is already £12. Greater Angular said it will cost me £10.25. No, we left with £3, and we left with £2, or something like that. I had a budget of £18 to begin with, and now it's £20. Now we've we spent £12.55. So I'm going to stop waffling, and let's enjoy the journey. Whenever you see these beautiful buildings, you know we're, we're putting into Bishop Stortford. Bishop Stortford was a very fun place to explore last time. So Bishop Stortford was the last place we went to. It was, I had a great time. And then we got this massive video. No, I'm not getting off here. Why is that train saying? Oh yeah. They can't. Yeah, they can't. They can't go any further. They've got to terminate at Bishop Stortford. They're yeah. gonna call out Harlow Town. I don't know. This is painful. <laughs> this one's on time. It's 11 44. I'm running an hour late. That says. When we get to Stance Mount Fitcher, then. Go oh, on to the platforms. Oh, I always have to say that. So, that couple that um, got on the train, they were actually kind of sweet, you know. Um, they've mentioned how they think they, they come from Low Soft. They've had a, I think they think they're going to or from Low Soft, I don't know. They said they had to do it, had to do it with soft. And then they've had a hold down the train, so they've, they can't get to where they want to go. No, the woman was actually really nice, lovely. Uh, 
you just enter the table there and make your journey just so much better. So here we are at Sense about Fiction. My phone glitch, but my final S glitch is it's annoying, but I'll deal with it. So here we are. Nothing looks like it's going well for anybody. Normally, sometimes I miss my train, and it's annoying. But there's always another one. Today, missing a train can be a really bad day. You've got all the days to miss a train, today's the worst day. Then you've got the main village over there. The village, it sounds from it, it's just a beautiful village. It's either a village or a small town. It's a really nice place. And I, like, and I love to visit here, particularly because I get to travel on the Stanton Express, so all the payment I come from. It just looks weird, I'm just holding on the camera stand, because I put my phone on the camera stand, and I couldn't really put it back in my bag, so that's an issue. Alright, let's find out what's going on. We've got Stanford Express, so you've got basically a very, very quick interchange. So things like it's going well at the moment. So, why about this interchange? Because um, it just looked like it would happen from Bishop Stortford, because you saw, well, I saw. That Stanton Express sitting in the sidings. And I knew that wasn't good. The Stanton Express they shouldn't sit in the sidings and they're going to terminate at Storeville. I've only seen that once, and that was last year in January before YouTube. So that's gone double yellow. A fast train. Well, I'm very happy to get the Stanford Express because that is part of what's going to be going on today. I have planned everything to go well. Phone's glitched again, that's why I'm going to be switching to an Apple iPhone uh, come by May. But it's really annoying as well because I have plan for ages for this and I'm gonna have to replan everything. It's fifty long, where's that train at? I was basically in a rush to get that Cambridge train because the thirty fourth got cancelled to Cambridge. I didn't really know what's gonna happen. Okay, got we got my train coming there. We've got a train there, Stats Express. I just want to answer that one yesterday. That's my phone. Oh, I could get a nice look inside the cab. That's nice, isn't it? Where's my sunset? Oh, is that, is that red? Oh, I don't think they've cancelled it. Don't turn the cancel bit. Oh no. Have I cancelled it? I think they have. Right, first we're gonna watch this one go. And then we'll see if it's been cancelled.
hasn't been cancelled, but I might as well have cancelled it. Because it's only going one stop now to Bishop Stortford. But that is because of flooding. And that's coming at 55. So that is really annoying. So it's like, instead of just getting on Status Express to Town, we're going to be getting Status Express only as far as Bishop Stortford, and then we're going to have to get probably a 720 to Broxbourne. Because we're going, we're going to have to go all the way up to Broxbourne now. And that's going to be a 10 minute journey. And that's going to be like a 15, 20 minute journey to get to Broxbourne. Obviously, they might as well cancel it. There might be a 745, I don't know. Well, let's see what the point is trying to send it. The Bishop's Dortmund, not on route to Liverpool Street. I do not know what has happened. It's just one of them days. But I don't often travel on days like this. But I've got no choice, I've got to travel. I was off, basically just fucked up the whole of YouTube. Oh, don't worry, the granny videos are still coming. I'm still making granny videos. I don't know what's happening or where it is. There's only delays on Cambridge trains and Stanford trains. Well, by the time we get to Broxbourne, I bet you there'll probably be uh, there'll probably be cancellations to half of these trains. We'll have a half an hour stopover in Hartford because it's gonna try and get there about nine minutes past the hour. And it doesn't go until 21 minutes to the hour. <sighs> it's already my first car. Well, I've not even been travelling for like 20 minutes yet. My phone is super glitchy. I don't want to go for a walk, but I don't want to miss this train. Okay. I don't know what's going to happen. I'm going to go back out for the post as a departure board. Okay. Now, this is just really weird. Now that I haven't cancelled it to Bishop Stortford, it's now going back to London. And it's coming literally now. Supposed to be now, it's 57. It's 58 now. It's expected at 57. This is really confusing. I don't know what's happening. I'm supposed to be here. So when I got here, oh, it's coming. I'll just do it. Uh, do it. Yeah, so this is going to London Liverpool Street now. It was going to Bishop Stortford. So we're going to have to get past Stortford. Right, yeah, this is definitely a Harlow Town stop up. If it works off in Harlow Town, it would be, you know, there's nothing here, we're stopping at Arlo, we be stopping at Arlo Town. I'm going to get on the train, we'll see what happens. Okay, we're just going to express, I'd literally not see, so I'm going to have to stand. Please check displays for further information. Mate, this train is just so busy. There's no seats. 
It's raining, still raining. That was a long journey. We stand for that picture, just standing. I mean, we were delayed at st we were delayed at Fort Stalking for about five minutes, so that red train to go through. That train is so busy, I'm glad we're off now. That was such a long journey. Our last night was the express train, but that was just too long. And I was hoping at Stalkford we would uh There'll be a seat, because some people did get off at Stortford, quite a few. Well, no, obviously they get a seat. So, now I've got to check what time the next train is. This time, actually. 12.17. I think there's no point now to spell in timetables. It's just whatever. Whatever great train you want to do, just whatever great train you want to do, to be honest. The red trains. Oh, I think they cut all the red trains. Oh, shit. Well, the trains have been cancelled. I don't know what to expect from all. Or maybe I don't know what to expect. The weather just looks miserable now. Nothing yeah. Okay. Yeah, but they could have fixed last night. That's going to be our one. It's going to be coming in four minutes. I'm going to, be under, I'm going to stand under the shelter. Because there's literally nobody. Okay. I 
he's just going to roll. Even the toy is out of order. So that hit? First I've been grow training is just out of order for the customer service today. It's now starting to rain. Just had to get rid of my bike. I got dropped off. <sighs> it's annoying to be honest. I need to get the box form to be in the clear. I think I mean rams though, because everyone's just been, no D, everyone's just been delayed, no D's getting anywhere. I need the toilet, but for some reason it's shut the one upstairs, so that's just, that's just even better customer service. And my last hope is Hartford East and the thingy. So quiet. The train will probably be rammed. But yeah, Scott we've got a gone signal. Let's just see what happens. I mean apparently it was very, very high flooding. And Doug Lake Smith's been a thing since 1792, fun fact. I'll only just buy this book just for that. That's going to Watford Junction. I still don't know whether to expect the train to be busy or not. Look at the platforms, there's no one here. I don't think I've ever seen Harlow Town this quiet when there's a train coming. Just for a train come. I mean, there's not one person on platform 3 and 4. This is something I would expect at Harlow Mill, but Harlow Town, this is just a different story. I mean, everyone got on a train just a minute ago here. There were some youths trying to get on the video. I don't really care for them, just wanna, just wanna shoot what I need to shoot. And it's coming now. So I'm gonna stand relatively just here. I mean if it's, I don't really care if it's too busy, I just wanna get a seat. Because I'm a bit disappointed I didn't get a seat on the Stanford Express. I mean my favourite train, and I can't even get a seat on, on my favourite train. This is 10 coaches. There's like two, there's like ten people. That's nothing. That's how I was, that is just nothing. I was getting trained. Oh, for fuck's sake, it's busy and all. Damn. Oh, you're joking. This ran, this train just ran. Alright, let's see if I can get a seat. Alright, here we are in Broxbourne. Again, another stander. This is just, this is just killing me mentally and physically. It stopped raining. I need to sit down mate, my legs are actually going to die, my legs are killing, that's two journeys in a row that I've been standing, I'm going to be used to pass from stands along the half of this time, that person wants to throw that up in the bag, if they're going in the bag or not, I'm going to go that's alright. Oh, this is that one. Well, I see this in service. Roxbourne is still quiet. Everybody's just quiet. Trains are just round. Yeah, I was just on diverted trains. Well, I'm just trying to get here. Well, for the break, we are heading back. Okay, it is now sunny. So it's just what is going on with the weather. It was raining at Harlow. I expect to be overly busy in Hartford. Oh, 
Oh no, I just did a left race here now. Oh, I could get to that, that's fine. I ain't got to that, I'll just don't fall up. You probably, had, you probably had too much to drink last night. It's very bright, we're now on platform 3. It's too bright today, I'm not prepared for this. I'm more prepared for the rain. I'm standing in the shade, I'm standing in the shade. So, uh, we can get a direct train to Wolf and Cross from here. But I'll do another quick look at, I'll do another quick stop in Chesons. I just hate this man. There's nobody on the platform. Nobody. We just feel like we're travelling in Covid. 53 to Cambridge has been cancelled. So now we're going to have to travel from around here upwards to London. So we're not going into London, we're boarding London by going into Waltham Cross. There's Falkland signaling at Stansted, which I should have fixed yesterday. I can't stress that enough. Because they're going to do engineering works, so I'll expect them to do it properly. And then there's very heavy rain this morning at Wolfram Cross. No, at uh, uh, on the end. That's why there's no. So there's no trains. And there are trains, but there's hands for them at reduced speeds. And they'll cancel that on the end. So I think we're the worst of it. I'm trying to Tottenham. If you're going to a football match, you're going to see that. Like West Ham and Tottenham. Norwich. Probably not so much. It is just so bright. Why is it right? The sun is just so random. I mean, it's all invisible. It's just five minutes down there. You can actually see where it's raining. Down there by the clouds. Until our face line comes, we're going to go onto the footbridge. There's going to be a train. There's going to be a train to come over there. I don't think I'm going to miss it. I said it got cancelled. I just can't see. It's the. Some have been cancelled, some have been cancelled. It's so bright. It's still red, so probably have been This train, will, this train probably won't be busy. It probably will be busy, but it will be seats. I bet it's just seats now. I've had to stand for a 10 minute journey from Stansted to London, which is very disappointing. But I'm still disappointed about it. That's the fact that my favourite trains. That's the trains I've gone on very rarely. You need 
these videos I always go I've got a bottle of water in my bath, so I drank. So, it's coming up to one, coming up to one o'clock. So I'm probably going to head to KFC soon. I'm going to head to KFC, get some food. I've got the boys running. It's a nice day today. It's going to be a nice day in some areas. It's going to be a shit day in some other areas. It's probably raining back home in Harlow. There's no stuff for trains, is there? I just realised that. So yeah, there's our train. That's going to take us in the water. Like a 10 minute journey, 10 minutes, something like that. I'm sorry, but it's very dry. Gold on the train, we've got empty seats. I can get a seat. We've got empty seats, let's go. Not this is the service to Hartford East. I mean, it's carriage is so much. Rye Hats. I won't be in the bath since so you bang red and lot of stuff. <sighs> Let's go. I've actually got a seat. This train is so empty. And this is going to London. Cool, something like that. It'd be unpacked. And fish pie is literally the worst. I hate fish pie. It's so bad. Let's go and head to the house this. Well, I didn't get to spill on these right now, we've got some very nice looking tampers. Towards Hartford. 
So, got a code that I'll get me a last popcorn chicken milk for four ninety nine. I assume popcorn chicken milk are a lot more expensive than that, but KFC saved me something there. So you can't go 50 miles an hour, can ya? Here we go. There's the bridge. Well, I have a stop over in Chesham, I've not been Chesham in ages. Maybe our right house, the beauty station of right house. Very nice station. Um, it'll, hopefully it'll come up in the top right corner of the screen now. When we went to right house in January 2024, this year, just last month. How are we going to be getting there? One o'clock. You have to say we're going to get there at one o'clock. Right house. Okay. Apparently we're going to get into half an Easter at one thirty-two. So it's going to be a ten-minute journey. It's going to turn into a half an hour journey. What was that? Actually, no, we'll be getting out half past. Let's have a look. I'm gonna bring my stuff with me just in case the train goes without me. The only thing to get is just where everything in my bag, nothing valuable. Well, you got my keys, I don't know if my keys are in there. Oh, level crossing, we just come out on over a level crossing. Look at this station. I do all these stations in here. I've never been to any of these. I've been to my house stuff prior to YouTube, but. I've never been here. I would like to explore, but that's just going to take me all day. Still got two, one more station to go. St. Margaret's. This is the service to Hartford East. Next station, where? I think we're still getting at half past one. I'll see when we get to where. Welcome to the service nice to from the driver. East. No trains we will be calling no, at where I thought that was a transport for me, because I just had a really nice time for the driver. Where do you live in here? Doesn't look too bad. That house looks like it's just made of where? DIY. This house just doesn't look too bad. Train is so empty, and this is the 
they are now approaching where? If you see something that doesn't look right, speak to staff or text the British Transport Police on 61016. We'll sort it. See it? Say it. There's no poor builds on hot leaves. Apparently there's going to be engineering works for no reason. That's alright. Young People Centre. Right, you've got a premier across the road. Got a beef eater. Only one platform oh, here. Hartford East. Yeah, one Next platform. Hartford East. Yeah, right, let me cross the uh, Still don't know if we're going to be putting in at one o'clock. I think that means that we would get in at um, tw at 1309. We would be getting at 32. That's, that's just a long journey. That's our 50 minute journey. Without further ado, let's go. Welcome to this service for Hartford East. We will be calling at Hartford East. Where is a nice place, isn't it? The next stop will be Hartford shows. East. I'm just going to Waltham Cross, I've already got a bus to Waltham Cross. What's the fun in there? Let's get the train. That looks oddly familiar. Yeah, that road could, I think that road goes into Brookfield. I don't know. And the building's over there. It's really sunny over here. I think it's just going to be for the sun, rain, clouds. That's probably going to be better towards when I go to Stansted, Stortford, we've already done that.
to the platform. I don't know what time this one's going. I think it's going at 39. That was 14 minutes to get here, so I don't know what I'm thinking, but it's going to take an hour. Body count, it's not going to be getting here, right? Thingy. So let's see what will happen now. Oh, East. Okay. Hartford East. This train terminates here. Let's have a look. On to the platforms and cool, this is nice, isn't it? Right, let's have a look at half of this. Let's see what this place is all about. Because this is a nice station, I'll be lying if, it, if I say it was it. We've got two trains here. Be the 1309 to London Street. Yeah, no, platform one, two. We've got to go back to the train we're just on. We've still got like eight minutes to explore. But that clock is broken. No, I'd be lying if I didn't say that half of these isn't a nice station. It is so nice here. So, this isn't the train we've got to get. We've got to go back on the train we just had. I don't really want to miss it. So, the next one won't be until 1339. And I still need to get to Cheshunt yet. Um, so, it's 02. I don't really want to walk down to the end of the platform, so I want to be on platform one, just so we can, you know, board the train when we need to board. So here we are on the beautiful station of Hartford East. This is the first terminal station, like proper terminal, I've been to on my own my traffic. I'm sure they should store for the terminal station, the Stratford trains, because it's not of complete terminal. Every train that goes there terminates there. This is the station. Every train terminates there. You've got a buffer there. You've got another buffer there. You know, there's nothing there. So here we are. Back on the first bit. So now we're back on the platform one. Um, under the roof. It's now time for us to head on to our return train to London. Well, what's in London to London? You know what I mean. So we've still got six minutes. This will get it at 31. So 30, so 30 and 28 we'll be getting to Chesant. So that's about 90 minutes. So we have a nice part of these stations. I don't think it's an exploration here. Now we're off that. 
It hasn't been too bad. I mean, I thought I'd be traveling for a lot longer, but I don't really know what there is else there is to do. There's not really many stations we're going to. I, mean, I could explore the whole half of this main line, but I'm looking to go back about three o'clock. Might. But before that, I've got a plane going overhead. Can't really tell what one it is. Just like a base 737 Max. Just there. Uh, I'll go to pick it up. Oh, I'll pick it up. So let's go the train. Okay, those. Let's try it. O5. Shot will be Chesant, so that's about a 90 minute journey, and then it's lunch at Walking Cross. Oh, we're going already on time at 13.09. We are ready to go. Welcome to this service for London Liverpool Street. We will be calling at Ware, St. Margaret's, My House, Roxbourne, Chesant. Waltham Cross, Enfield Lock, Brimsdown, Ponders End, Tottenham Hale, Hackney Downs, and London Liverpool Street. Lovely. Oh, well, I'm not even going to lie to you, so what? I don't want to sit in the bed like this. I could just sit in the table. So, actually, you know what? Let's go sit the table now. You know, I basically sat on what we sat on earlier. On our trip to Stanton and I'll pitch it. We have to do what I want, basically. Oh, someone's left a jacket here, that's unfortunate. That is really unfortunate. I feel bad that I've left it here. So I sometimes have anxiety attacks, but I've left something in the train. That would not be nice to do. So let's enjoy the journey. And, yeah. See you when we get to box board or present. Because you already know what it's like here. We've got this one platform at Square, really nice station at St. Margaret's, and I've already been to Wright House and I've already been to Box Board millions of times. I've already been to Chesant. So yeah, you already know what's coming. Alright, here we are, Chesant. It is so busy. I didn't say onto the platform to have my pads. I don't know why it is so busy. All the other stations I've been to are not busy. We've got lunch. Here. Okay. I'll tell you about two bags. One way to go home, I can get this train. I don't want to go home from there. Um, I've still got delays. I've gone about all. I've, I've got about all the delays. Whether it says none where I was, so I ain't, ha I ain't got to worry. Well, I might go for a walk as well. Uh, you know what, I might go on the overground once to pop the line. Why not? Once to pop the line, go get off, and then come back to children. There's going to be about 32 when I get back. There's going to be like... I'm going to train there. 
Let me mark and be coming back. Hive ground, maybe on the other ground for ages. So. Better run. Maybe on the other ground since 2019. Well, never been. Ages. What side are we in? We are in turn eight. We get up at Fearbolt Grove. This is the train to Liverpool Street via Seven Sisters. Oh, never heard that one before. He's got earbuds in anyway, so I don't think he can hear me. Oh my god. Low pressure. I don't actually know if he's just turned 8. We're going into turned 7, so that's not too bad. We've got to get back into London. We've got to get back into um, Chesant. I'll even say I'll be going up to Theobald Grove. Theobald Grove's the next station. Which is the next station, Theobald's Grove. Okay, here we are. Let's go. Check 
车程，你才三车。So it's an overground station, so of course we're going to be above the ground. Let's go to the bridge. Now I'm feeling a bit paranoia. Um, but we've got a 25 minute wait until the next one. Well, it's time for the train driver as well. Oh, that's a, a um, memorial one. Okay. So this is a very empty station in turn 7 at Theobald Grove. We've got to get a train now back to London. So it's one binge. Let's head back up the stairs. Well, it's time to get to the bench. Let's go on to the next time we're going to go to the travel to will be Edmonton Green sometime in March. Here we are. We're going to get trained to Chesant. Here we are. Is at the colour ten to ten to two. Well, that is a very long way down. This station is just deserted, so we've got thirteen minutes till it comes. Hopefully, just no one questions it. But I don't actually know if this is in zone seven and zone eight. Oh, I've only got a ticket fine for some six. Oh, I mean, I've only got this train just because I'm bored. I think we are literally on the outskirts of London. I think Waltham Cross is outskirts of London. Ah, oh, this might be literally just inside London. That's why I'm also a bit nervous about that as well. So we've got 12 minutes until the train comes. Then we get to Chess and I'll be chill again. I don't even know what time the overbound, what time my Wolfram Cross train will be. Or we'll come by Wolfram Cross, it'll be lunchtime. So we can head. Wherever until three o'clock. So three o'clock that'll be about a four hour recording session. You know the video won't be four hours. And we've been out the bat for four hours. Normally it's two hours. Because of how long there's traffic and how there's very little trains. It's been a nice day out. I would say it's been a nice day out. Fearboard Scrove is completely deserted. There's not one person here. It's going to draw a bit more suspicion. Uh, other than the fact that they're, they're sickening problems and it was flooding, other than that, everything's been good. The day's been up and down. But by the time I get back, the pre sickening problems will be over. Or probably there will still be sickening problems, but the flooding will be gone. Let's have a look. Got this end. Very small platforms as well, isn't there? I believe, I think this can only fit like a five, six car train in here. Back gardens and all. And I feel like I'm in 
in the Luton town of my end. Apparently this could fit up to eight coaches, which I'd be very much believe because down the underground it's got very really small coaches. We've got the classic ones on the ground logo there, not not both ground. Sorry. There's nobody here. There might be a couple of people waiting for a train to Chesant. There wasn't many on the train. Got nine minutes. I don't think anyone will question my ticket. I never get questioned the ticket ever. So, probably, I don't know question it this time. It is so quiet here. Might as well be exploring at least due station with Jeff Marshall and the Bandon station. Oh, you've got the moon over there with a plane. There's the moon, it's there. We'll get a plane to fly by. There we go. It's there. We've got a plane. Will it tell us? For. These are what is the wheelchair things. We've got eight minutes. Oh, I was that was quite a quick stopover. We got here about 35, 35 minutes to the hour. So it's not been a, a long stopover. We'll definitely get longer stopovers in like Royden, stations like that. Sorbetworth, we get a quick stop over, so I'll probably prefer to stop over something like Stanston Mount Fitchett. Will do. I ain't really a grass, so I don't really report anything really. I don't like grasses. Lovely, I'm getting watched by CCTV. Definitely nothing suspicious here, boys. I'm going to have a look over the underpass. I don't know why there's an underpass, you get normally a footbridge. Probably because you've got the overhead wires, so that's an issue, isn't it? Yeah, I'm pretty well I've got an underpass. I don't know why the underpass has got to be so low down. That's, the underpass goes down to ground level. I don't know how high we are. We're not that high. I'll probably say we're about. 20 feet, 10 feet. We've got someone on the roof down there. Putting that treasure only. Let's try and be in 7 minutes on time. Which is a good thing, I want to be on time. So I've got to keep everything precise with the walking cross train. Hopefully, the walking cross train is delayed. I've got a pigeon. That's nice, little station. Look, you've got a nice little cathedral here. We have, a London Underground worker saw me. I've seen three. I've seen one on the train, one getting on the train, and I saw one smokers. I think the one smoker doesn't really care that much, really. These weather, it's really going to rain. I'm going to have to see where the cathedral grows. It's actually in London. If I miss this, I've got to wait. 30 minutes, and I'm definitely going to miss walking across the train. I do not know the timetable at the moment, especially if I just have this Sunday today. So I've been travelling on two Sundays in a row. So, I always love how my phone picks everything up. Nice little dot matrix, I haven't seen dot matrix for a while. Everything called great things, system screen things. But that dot matrix are nice, you love dot matrix. Someone tagged Jeff Marshall on that. 
Tra- I need train influence, just to know what I'm talking about. Tag Jeff Marshall. Jeff Marshall's definitely coming. You've got Ben slapping the wind. You've got a of things down there. You've got Dot Matrix. Everything Jeff Marshall would love, even the shelter. So I'm going to take this video to Jeff Marshall. We've got five minutes. I guess they've. Only when they need to, they only need to send that to yellow for like a minute, something like that. Um, yeah. I can't wait to get back to Cheson. I'm so excited to get back to Cheson. I don't even know why I'm here at Fearballs Grove. Why have I even gone on the overground in the first place? Probably because I have never, never been on the overground in years, and also for the fact I'm bored at Cheson. I ain't got food. I don't mean no longer do it at Cheson. Like a train spot, but I was fun in that. Oh. I've got my phone, it's game over. Less than my stage here. A motorbike. There's a motorbike down there. What's down there? Uh, it might be game over. Yeah, you got a motorbike down there. And just a pile of tyres. So the form is F1, never need any tyres, then I'm fearful to go. Got a red signal. Probably should feel concerned, probably shouldn't. No, so in March we'll be heading to Edmonton Green. That's going to require a bit of safe as well. I don't know how I'm going to get to Edmonton Green actually. Yellow. That's good, very good. Very, 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 very good. Let's see if we go green now. Oh, that's work. That's work. That's work. You know, that's really my question, but no one grades me, will question it. It's 47. I'm so excited to go back. I don't know what time I'm trying to go So 15 minutes stopover. Next we've got I don't know how long the stopover's gonna be in Chesant. Yeah. It's 48 with 21 seconds. 13 48, 21 seconds. I don't know what time to get lunch. Lunch is gonna take a while. I wanna enjoy my lunch. It's 48 now, 86. I definitely just go to the toilet when I get to the toilet. I don't have any toilets here. And if I do, I'll probably work that and piss against the wall. That's what I'd rather do. Still yellow. I'm about to sink up to 49. The train will be coming. Hopefully they work like great train, you know, and come one minute early. I want to get out of here. I do not want to be at Fearboard Grove anymore. 49, 11, 10, 11, 14, 13, 14. I don't know what time we'll be back at Hollow Mill yet. I might actually, yeah, no, I'll go to Hollow Mill, Hollow Town. Yellow. 
Here it comes. Let's go to the train. Let's go to the driver. This is 710 Let's board the train. We'll get that in two seconds. Toast in the tube, and I'm not going on the tube. I'll be, be queuing videos in about two years' time. I'm only 14, mate. I'm starting to show I'm 13. I'm 14 now. So. CCTV cameras. Uh, we're now back at Chesson. Like a slow. I quite enjoyed it, it was good. So 
देख रहे हैं Watch the film, mate. Not gonna bloody call someone beside my head. That's right, mate. Wait for my train. All right, cheers, mate. This is 720. I'll have my differences. It's now green. That's close to 720. It's now fast approaching. Oh, yeah, that'd be called the Weaver Line then. So they're going to be called in different means the overground Weaver Lines. Things and coin lines, different things. I'll first just, just, just keep it London Overground. My lights already on. There we go, it's coming. It's our last one before lunch. It's now two minutes to two. Boys, 
was going for lunch. We've been going now for about two hours. I don't know what's going on back down the line. Still delays. I don't know what's going on back towards Harlow. As far as I'm aware, there's been no delays. Ah, he's definitely a Stuxx Express. He just has that Stuxx Express. Over there. We were just over there a minute ago, on the train. Us uh, in Sam. Because the Overground Sandwich is that bit. We, we and the Overground Sandwich is them houses. Approaching Wolfram Cross. Wolfram Cross now approaching. Let's take off another station. Oh, right, let's take off that next station. So, incredibly busy. Okay. Oh, cross. Let's go. Oh, so this is Jeff Marshall. Sunday. It's Sunday. I don't say anything for Sunday. Oh, here we are. On a meal. See the KFC over there, see the K. Um, that's the end of this segment of the video. Then, I guess I'm to eat, and then we'll be right back to the railway for the last hour or so. I'm definitely not going to be praying there. not looking good. It's not looking good at the moment. I'm just going to see. I'm not going to... Um, I probably won't record. I'm going to see. I'm going to board in this carriage. And I'll see you at Harlow Town. Okay, that went really badly. Uh, we've been kicked off on the store. Alright. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. 
kita akan langsung was the fact we had some out from the the last leg of the trip. It's the last train of this video. Our brave was the fact we had some out from the Bishop Stortford. This is the service to London Liverpool Street. Next station, Fallbridge Road. to the platform. That is the very last time to know we're going to say that. We have been travelling since 11.34am. The time is now 16.30. The time is now 16.35. Yeah, the time is 16.35. So we've been travelling for about five hours. Uh, if you did enjoy this long video, please do like and subscribe. It really helps me out a ton. And I will see you next time when we head on the trains.